Today, we will guide you through the payment structure on the admin panel. When you click on the payments button, you will be redirected to the payment screen. This is where the admin manages all transactions made by both customers and drivers. On the transaction screen, the admin can view customer and driver transactions. When the admin clicks on a transaction number, they can see all the detailed transactions made by that particular customer or driver. For instance, if a transaction involved multiple rejections, such as trip requests or cancellations, the system applies penalties to the respective accounts. The system also displays the previous wallet balance, the previous credit balance, and the most recent transactions. The admin has the ability to apply filters by driver, projects, and transaction details. The admin can also filter transactions by date. Once filters are applied, the admin can export the transaction data, which will be sent to the admin's email. Moving on to the top-up section, the admin can see all top-up requests generated by customers or drivers. If a transaction fails for any reason, the data will be listed in the admin panel. The admin can then approve or reject these transactions. The admin also has the ability to filter this data by customer and date and can export the data to see how many top-up requests have been made so far. Lastly, the admin has the ability to top up a specific customer's account. This could be for various reasons. The admin can search for the customer by name or number. The data will then appear in the listing and the admin can proceed with the transaction. They enter the amount and select the mode of payment received. Once this is done, the admin can select the transaction type this indicates the purpose of the top-up, whether it's for the customer's wallet or the tower wallet. By clicking on the Submit button, the amount will be topped up in the customer's account. In the same manner, the admin can top up driver accounts as well. We have recently added a new feature called Import. This allows the admin to import multiple driver or customer accounts at the same time. If the admin wants to top up multiple driver or user accounts simultaneously, they can do so by importing a CSV file. This eliminates the need for manual top-ups for each account. Moving on to the withdrawal process, it is similar to the top-up process. The admin can withdraw money from a customer or driver's account. To do this, they simply click on the Withdraw button, select the customer's name, and enter the amount they wish to withdraw. They then select the payment type and proceed with the withdrawal let's discuss why they are withdrawing money from their accounts. Are they withdrawing the money for personal use or are there other reasons? Once you click on the submit button, the amount will be withdrawn from either the customer or the driver's account. Similarly, if anyone wishes to withdraw money from multiple customer or driver's accounts, they can do so with the use of the CSV feature provided by the CS. Once the top up and withdrawal features are blocked, the final feature is the balance. From here, the admin can view all transactions made by the customers and drivers. Essentially, from this point, the admin can see the balance of each customer and driver. They can see how much credit balance each individual has. Also, there is a filter option, where the highest and lowest balance data can be sorted by clicking on the filter button. In this way, the data can be organized. Furthermore, the admin can export the balance data from the admin panel. The exported data will be delivered via email. Lastly, there is a search filter. If anyone wants to view specific customer or driver data, they can apply the filter and find the specific data in the listing. So that is the use of the payment screen. The admin can see all transactions made by the customers or drivers. They can top up and withdraw from the customer or driver's account. And in the balance screen, the admin can see the current balance of each customer and driver's account.